Hi, welcome to Cafe Two Two Nine. Today, we're so excited to have the very first Shaolin monk come to our show. Sifu Si Yanmin is with us today. Amitofo. Amitofo. Thank you for coming. Thank you, Sifu. I met Sifu when I was a teenager. When he first came to America in '92, and your story is so excited. I mean, this is the first time we've seen a Shaolin monk, and I think our audience before, before you came, I think we probably just watched the David Carradine TV show or Kung Fu, where there's a real, where's a Shaolin monk come to America, but then we never seen a real one, and then you're the very first one that arrived. So can you tell us a little bit about Shaolin? Because I'm not sure all. Our audience know what Shaolin Temple is about. Absolutely, let me talk for. Thank you for the opportunity. Thank you for coming to the USA Shaolin Temple. I have the precious time to speak out to let people know what the Shaolin Temple martial arts means.、Mm-hmm. Shaolin Temple martial arts has every style.、Mm. Back to the history, beginning of the Song Dynasty. Okay. Yeah. First abbot, Grandmaster Fu Yu.、Mm-hmm. He invited best martial artist. Okay,、uh, come from you know different places, different states,、mm. and China come came to the Shaolin Temple. Okay, yeah, three times, each each time three years,、mm. nine years together. Okay, yeah, basically they fought, they were agreed, they were disagreed.、Mm-hmm. Yeah, they combined all the martial arts together. Okay, to the Shaolin Temple martial arts.、Mm-hmm. Shaolin Temple martial arts has not only、uh, empty hands forms, <laughs> weapons. Okay. Of course, of course self defense.、Mm. Of course, importantly, when you practice Shaolin Temple martial arts, you practice Chan philosophy.、Mm. That's a big difference.、Yeah. So, so Shaolin is known for martial arts, but is also known for its important philosophy, which is Chan Buddhism. Yes. So, so Sifu, can you tell us a little bit about how? What is Chan, and how is it related to fighting? Right, it, it, because I, I, we all often assume Chan Buddhism is about peace, but like, how is that related to martial arts? How Shan Temple Chan philosophy related to martial arts? Yeah, yeah. Martial arts is life. We, in Chinese, we call kung fu.、Mm, kung yeah. fu. Yeah, from early day to late evening to sharp your blade.、Mm. To sharp your life, sharp your blade, sharp your life. Exactly. If you don't stay sharp, your life、mm-hmm. just like a sharp blade you don't use、mm-hmm. become rusty. Okay. That's why you have to always and challenge yourself,、mm-hmm. encourage yourself, and self discipline yourself.、Mm-hmm. Yeah. Get up and do some exercise.、Mm-hmm. Yeah. Chan means life. Chan means everything. Yeah. The founder of Chan philosophy, Chan Buddhism. Indian monk,、mm-hmm. Damo, yeah, found it.、Mm-hmm. Basically, there's no nothing to speak.、Mm-hmm. There's nothing to talk about it.、Mm-hmm. Yeah, there are many things to to talk about it.、Mm-hmm. Sure. <laughs> <laughs>、yes. I, right, right.、Yeah. So Bodhidharma or Damo, who brought Chan or Zen from India to China, I know, and he was famous, known to say that. Chan or Zen is indescribable. It's you cannot describe it. But then at the same time, Chan is everything. So, so Sifu, can you get a little bit more into what is Chan? What is Zen?、Right. Absolutely, yes.、Yeah. Originally, in China,、uh, we call Chan Buddhism.、Mm-hmm. Zen Buddhism, for example, in the Western world,、mm-hmm. we say Zen Buddhism. Right. Yeah. And back to the history. Back to the Song Dynasty, like one thousand years ago,、mm-hmm. and Japanese monk went to the Shan Temple.、Mm-hmm. They studied,、okay. they brought,、uh-huh. or they invited、uh-huh. the Chan Buddhism to Japan. Okay, yeah, that's basically you know every、uh, single person, every you know cultural people different, people people are different.、Mm-hmm. Yeah, sure,、uh, the food different. And everybody speaks different languages. Sure. For example, in China, we have fifty-six nationalities. We have over one thousand dialects. All right. Yeah. <laughs> Just like Buddha said, that there are different doors、mm-hmm. and different doors, and for different people,、mm-hmm. and to walk through their lives. 
Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, so when so Buddhism is passed from India to China, then from China to Japan. So what, when, but but what was it exactly passed down from India to China to Japan? Like, what is it? Like, what is it that's really passing down? You feel? I feel that the Buddhism we've been invited and. Um, from India to China, mm -hmm. back to the Tang Dynasty. Mm -hmm. Tang is 14 centuries ago. Yeah, in compared with Chinese history, that's like a, still very young. Mm -hmm. You know, you study history, you mm -hmm. study philosophy. Mm -hmm. That's why we are here. We are here, face to face. Right. We, have, we are having conversation, right. and try to send messages out, and mm -hmm. try to help people. Mm -hmm. Yeah, basically Buddhism, EMF understanding. In my life, mm -hmm. from many years of practicing, yeah, and sharing, and teaching people, mm -hmm. and yet you, yet you say, Fa Fa, mm -hmm. which kind of philosophy? If you talk to people, mm -hmm. people don't understand, mm -hmm. and people cannot get it. Just like we are living life, we have grounded foot, mm -hmm. feet, mm -hmm. step by step to walk, and life to, to towards mm -hmm. forward. Mm -hmm. Yeah, if the philosophy you teaching. The message, the message you're sending, mm -hmm. people don't understand. They cannot catch it. Mm -hmm. Sure, yeah. they cannot board it. Mm -hmm. And to their lives, to their lives, and to help them to grow. Mm -hmm. That doesn't matter whatever you teach. Right. Yes. So philosophy is only useful when it is practical. When you can only use it in life. Exactly. Right. Exactly. So, so I think. I'm sure, as a first Shaolin monk in America, that must be a lot of a culture shock for you. Just like many of us in New York City, so many of us are immigrants. Right. So, so I guess one good example you can give us is how did Buddhism help you to cope as an immigrant in America? Because this is such a you know big big place for uh, for many many different people to be together. Absolutely, I'm, I I love. You know, to stay in New York City, <laughs> I still believe it. Yes, it's the capital of the world. Uh -huh. People come from different backgrounds, different religions, mm -hmm. different countries. Wherever you know, you you can find different people from different places. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's why I choose the New York City, and to spread Chinese philosophy mm -hmm. and to spread and Shaolin Temple martial arts mm -hmm. in the capital of the world. Yeah, and. Yeah. Everybody's different. Everybody's beautiful. Mm -hmm. That's why, like, uh, for example, Chan philosophy, you cannot use one way yeah, to, to teach people, for example, or go sit mm -hmm. to meditate. Right. Yeah, to cleanse your mind, cleanse, cleanse your heart, mm -hmm. internal uh, cleanse, become so fresh, so clean, mm -hmm. to understand life is precious, how to live. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no stress. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? N you know, nothing to worry about life. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's why I choose New York. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's very interesting because I have students come from different backgrounds. Yeah, yeah. In, including you know, actor, actors, mm -hmm. lawyer. Yeah, and different yeah. backgrounds. You know, the uh, including homeless. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you get to meet many different people in New York City for I love sure. It. I love it. That's yeah. why I chose New York City. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So, so I I think from meeting all these different people. I think you mentioned something that's important, which is you you have a wish to help different people to thrive, to grow, to become who they are, because that is sort of the spirit of Zen or Chan, which is to help us to live our to be the best we can be in some sense. So so can you share some story with us on how you help someone in New York City? Absolutely, you know, and people in New York City. People come to me, come to Shan Temple. Mm -hmm. First, first, I have to explain to them. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you come to handsome shifu. Rather, the words you see, yeah. <laughs> handsome, handsome, handsome shifu. Yeah. Maybe we have to zoom in this <laughs> one. <laughs> handsome shifu. Okay. Handsome, come to handsome shifu, <laughs> and then you come to the Shan Temple. Nobody change your religions. Mm. Nobody change what you believe. Mm. Yeah. Buddha. It's good. Jesus Christ is fantastic. <laughs> God is awesome. Uh, yeah, Muhammad is phenomenal. What do you believe? 
Say what you believe. Uh-huh. Yeah. Nobody change you. You change yourself. Mm-hmm. Nobody can help you. You help yourself. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's why I said. Exclusive. That's why I said that. Talk to them first. Mm-hmm. Uh, explain to them first. Mm-hmm. Yeah. You come to me. You study some type of Chinese philosophy. Some study some type of martial arts. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Don't stop yourself. Don't draw a line. Mm-hmm. Open your mind. Open your heart. Uh-huh. Yeah. That's philosophy. That's knowledge. Yeah. Right. I that's I try to make examples for people. Mm-hmm. I'm. The most handsome Shuang Temple warrior monk on the planet. <laughs> I can go to church. I can say Amen. No problem.、Mm-hmm. Yeah, just different yeah. pronunciation. Just、mm-hmm. like God bless you,、mm-hmm. Buddha bless you. Yeah, you know,、uh, Amen. It's,、mm-hmm. it's beautiful. You know, the, cannot is one way to give knowledge、mm-hmm. to everybody.、Mm-hmm. Yeah, cannot use one way to let them to borrow it in their life、mm-hmm. to live. So the the philosophy of Chan is really that we all can be free, just like what Bruce Lee said, "Be water, right?" Exactly. We we are all water. Just sometimes we treat ourselves almost like an ice, and we see people as ice.、Mm-hmm. So when we can melt ourselves, we can also melt other people. So it seems like the way you teach is by being the example of that freedom, right? You demonstrate that freedom by what you do. So in your school, you have. Different people, people from many different religion, come to you, but you demonstrate by embracing all different beliefs and practices, and you yourself also respect all religion and all practices, which that is a very good way. Often we say true teaching is not by what you say,、right. but by what you do. Exactly. Yeah. You, that's what by true teachers, the words most of the time. Doesn't make sense. That's what I. <laughs> I that's that's like a Chinese philosophy, for example.、Uh, uh-huh. Yeah, you speak out like a, a change the meanings.、Mm-hmm. That's why I said, action, action speaks、mm-hmm. louder than words.、Mm-hmm. Yeah, you can say how much you can do, demonstrate.、Mm-hmm. Yeah, demonstrate. That's that's the the way to help people、mm-hmm. from my life from my my life. Yeah, from my、yeah. life. That's why I said, you know, you come to me. I can do it.、Mm-hmm. I can demonstrate.、Mm-hmm. I can show show the way.、Mm-hmm. You cannot get it.、Mm-hmm. You have to question yourself. <laughs> if I can, if I want to speak,、mm-hmm. I cannot do it.、Mm-hmm. I cannot demonstrate. How can you study from me?、Mm-hmm. That's what I teach myself. I teach my people.、Mm-hmm. Be honest with yourself. Ah, I teach. I I, I send the messages out.、Mm-hmm. You know, whatever you teach teach teachers. Whatever you teach, you、mm-hmm. have you have to have the knowledge.、Mm-hmm. Yeah, otherwise don't teach it. I,、mm-hmm. I, I always discipline myself, master、mm-hmm. myself.、Yeah. So I think you point a very important point here、yeah. is、uh, part of being a Chan practitioner is to be genuine and honest, right? We don't we don't talk the path, we walk the path. So so I think it's quite important. Like you know, sometimes we say, "Oh, we want to help people doing this and that," but our action does not match the words. Exactly. So, so what what you're teaching your students is be genuine. What what's inside, try to match what's the outside. Exactly. Yeah, that's what that's what you know. I teach people, for example, yeah, why we stretch. Why stretch?、Mm-hmm. You stretch out. Your exercise. Your stress, of your life. Mm-hmm. Stress is is poison.、Mm-hmm. You stress, you stress can can knock you out.、Mm-hmm. Can make you sick.、Mm-hmm. That's just, that's just dangerous. That's very, that's very、uh, sickness.、Mm-hmm. Yeah. So even a simple stretching has its philosophical meaning behind exactly. it. Exactly. Yeah. Everybody, everybody has flexibilities. If you don't keep stretching, you don't keep your flexibilities.、Mm-hmm. You can you're going to lose. <laughs> that's why I said. Every year we're getting younger. You don't you don't stretch it. You don't exercise.、Uh-huh. Your 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 body just falling off the part.、Mm-hmm. Just like sharper blade, what you don't use,、yeah. just put there, never touch it.、Mm-hmm. It become rusty. Right. Life same thing. You、mm-hmm. have to always discipline yourself. You have to always challenge yourself.、Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, 
Kung Fu is life. It's life. Life is Kung Fu. Exactly. Right. Yeah. This is what you teach your students. So, and our body and mind should be together. Simply, we to make people understand that. For example, your your body tired, mental said. Uh, body said to mental, go to work. <laughs> go go to store buy uh, you know some food for me. Mm-hmm. Impossible. Right. Yeah. In general, it's a simple way to let you understand that mm-hmm. the body and mind together. Mm-hmm. Just like uh, you know, Shan Temple, uh, we say Quan Chan Yi Ti, Quan means fist, fist or martial arts. Mm-hmm. Chan means Chan philosophy. Mm-hmm. Yi means one, mm-hmm. one body. Yeah. Yeah. Simply kind of separate. Mm-hmm. Yeah. The fist and Chan are unified. Are Are one. Uh, one. Yes. Yeah, that's yes. exactly yeah. where. Exactly. Right. Yeah. Right. And that is very. And when our fist, I guess, and 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 Chan as one, we are genuine and free. Exactly. Right. Yes. Yeah. Right. And and when we're free, we're able to also be more kind and helpful to other people. Exactly. You've been free. Actually, you open your mind. You open your mind. Open your heart. Don't draw a line. Oh, mm-hmm. I'm Buddhist. I cannot go to the church. Mm-hmm. I, I'm. I believe Jesus Christ, God. I cannot go to the temple. Mm. What's the difference? Yeah. Yeah. Try you know, open your mind, mm-hmm. open your heart. Yeah. Combine them together, blending them together. The philosophy that's yours. Mm-hmm. You knowledge yourself. Mm-hmm. Well, you can help others. Mm-hmm. You can help the world. You can make a better place mm-hmm. for the people to live. Through the Shaolin martial art training, we learn to be more open. Right, we learn to be out of our comfort zone, and we learn to be not stuck with the labels that we put on ourselves. Like I'm this, I'm this, and I'm that, and then we kind of limit ourselves. Exactly. So, so from the training with you and the training from the Chan approach, we really learn to let go of all those labels and fixate fixated views of who we are and who other people are. So this is quite freeing. Now, I know you have many well-known students. I mean, your students ranges from movie actor, actor. <laughs> I mean, actor, actress to hip hop artists to. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Yo, peace, love, <laughs> respect. You know what I mean? Yeah. I know one of your most favorite <laughs> students, probably Wu Tang Clan. <laughs> and and I know you have like so many nicknames. Sometimes people call you the. Hip hop monk, monk, yes. Right. Sometimes people call you the rebellious monk. How do you feel about those labels on you? I, I love it. Whatever people you know call me, I I, I appreciate that. <laughs> that's what I said. Whatever people you know call me, that's respect. Mm-hmm. I take that way. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it doesn't matter. That's what in the Buddhism we say, 无人相，无众生相，无受者相。嗯 ，Yeah. 不要做 ，Don't draw a line.、Mm-hmm. Yeah. That you become teacher,、mm-hmm. be, become 师傅、mm-hmm. ，master. Not only just master,、mm-hmm. like father, like mother,、mm-hmm. like a cousin, like a brother, sister, like nephews. You have to bonding with different people.、Mm-hmm. You have to use different way to approach,、yeah. to help people individually, not in a one way to teach people.、Mm-hmm. So, yeah, so, yeah. so what you just mentioned、yeah. is a very well known、yeah. quote from the Diamond Sutra, which is to be formless, right? And and when when we're formless, we're able to connect. Right, we're able to connect and and feel and relate to everyone as brothers and sisters, and then we can be more helpful. So, so Sifu, I just just curious. I mean, <clears throat> I myself practice martial art, and there's a lot of stuff you do. There's no way I can do. I mean, you. I mean, I see some of the video. <laughs> your students are doing those are like very hard to do, and I'm sure I'm not the only one who cannot do some of the most amazing thing. That you do, so I just wonder among all these students, what do you teach to the elderly? What do you teach to the young adults? Like, how do you adjust to them? I teach different people, different ages.、Mm-hmm. Yeah, nobody old, nobody young. Okay, nobody tall, nobody short, nobody you know,、uh, overweight, skinny. The Shang Temple Masters or Shang Temple、uh, Chan philosophy belong to everybody. Mm-hmm. Yeah, everybody can get benefited.、Mm-hmm. Yeah, just do your best. Just do your best. Just just do it. <laughs> just jump in, do it. Yeah, first, first, you have to believe in yourself. Ah, trust yourself. Yeah, you you see, you have 
no confidence. You cannot believe yourself. Mm -hmm. You're already beating yourself up. Yeah. You cannot do it. Mm -hmm. just, just do it. Yeah. First, first, you know, self confidence. Mm -hmm. Self confidence is the key. Ah. It's the first, first one in life. Mm -hmm. I think Nike should ask you to do a commercial with them, right? You know, that, that, just do it. Just do it. Yeah, exactly. Just do it. Seriously, I mean, a lot of people, I just, you know, we talk about, we have this conversation. Yeah. Uh, I'm tall. You, you're not old. You're, you're already, you already draw a line. You're a label yourself. Right, right. You're a label right. yourself, not old. Mm -hmm. Yeah. If you, if, if you truthfully cherish you, your, your life, cherish yourself. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm not old. You can, anytime you want to start, you can start. Mm -hmm. It doesn't matter. You do like a weapons, practice weapons, mm -hmm. uh, uh, hands forms. Mm -hmm. Yeah, whatever, just do it. Okay. Yeah. So, 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 so the key ingredient mm -hmm. that you would help your student to uh, to cultivate is the sense of self confidence. It's like quite an important aspect. I think you definitely need a lot of self-confidence for the audience who never seen the shouting. <laughs> uh, I mean, you need quite a lot of confidence, but once you could do those moves, it's quite amazing that how much potential we can have just to do all that different training that you went through. Can you say a little bit about how Shaolin train you to have that self-confidence and help you to deal with difficulties in life. Like, I, I, I assume when everyone come to America for the first time, like in 92, when you, you know, Long basically time. just suddenly left your group, I'm sure there are a lot of challenges. So can you share with us those challenges and how you dealt with it? Facing challenges, facing difficulties, mm -hmm. everybody has it. Yeah. First, first, understand that that's part of life. Mm -hmm. You have to face it. Just like a problem come to our lives. Mm -hmm. Don't run away. Face it. Ah, face the problem. You fix the problem. Mm -hmm. You can, with, with your confidence, can destroy the problem. Mm -hmm. Fix the problem. If you run away, you come back again, the problem getting bigger. In my life, I keep saying that. I keep teach my students, my followers. Mm -hmm. In our lives, it's nothing is easy, nothing is difficult. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the easy things you don't want to do it. You have no confidence. Mm -hmm. Just like drinking water. Oh, you don't. <laughs> you you're scared. You're gonna choke yourself. Mm -hmm. The food you scared. <laughs> <laughs> you 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 chewed. You don't chew. You swallowed. You're gonna choke yourself. You know. And That's you true. Walk on the street. You 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 have no confidence. Oh, mm -hmm. maybe. You know, a stone falling down from the sky, yeah. you get hurt. Mm -hmm. You have to have the confidence. Mm -hmm. Understand it's part of life. Mm -hmm. That's what make you know our lives interesting. Mm -hmm. And to live. Yeah. That's why I said every moment, every day was a beautiful gift. Mm -hmm. Cherish it. Mm -hmm. And simply, you know, we just cannot afford it to waste it. Basically, what you help your student is to build that ability. And, and confidence to face the all difficulties of life. Because without facing your difficulties, nothing will happen. Exactly. Right. right. You have you have to face and you know, understand we're already here. <laughs> we're already here. Yeah. There, there are many choices. You choose. You want to move forward? You want to stay same place? You want to go backwards? Mm -hmm. No. Get up. Mm -hmm. Facing. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> Get up. Stand tall, facing realities. Mm. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Have the confidence. Yeah. You yeah. can execute. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You can, you can do everything you want to do. You can mm -hmm. accomplish yeah. in life. I, I agree very much what you yeah. say because I think what one thing, one great benefit of martial art is to help you feel, feel stronger and have the right mental attitude. We don't run away from difficulties, exactly. yeah. but we face our difficulties. Yes. So Sifu, what was the most challenging <laughs> difficulty you had in your life after you come to the US? Uh, difficult challenge I had, I, I cannot find, to be honest. <laughs> yeah, dude, I, I cannot find, I feel I'm like a very lucky person on the planet. Okay. Always you know, beautiful people, loving, lovely people, 
come to my life mm-hmm. yeah give me hope give me courage mm-hmm. yeah give me support mm-hmm. yeah that's why you have to make yourself understandable mm-hmm. yeah that's why I say don't lock yourself out mm-hmm. I'm Buddhist I'm I'm Christian I cannot go the temple I cannot go to a, a church no mm-hmm. open mind open heart blend study them all mm-hmm. yeah blending them together mm-hmm. that's your knowledge that's your philosophy I, yeah. I think what I hear yeah. then yeah. is that what also helped you not just personal confidence but what's even more important is because you're open-minded you're free you're able to meet many different people and many so there are many helping hands that come along your way that help you to face the difficulties together exactly you know I'm very lucky also that, that in my life, last beautiful people. That's why I say you have to understand yourself, respect yourself. Mm-hmm. Yeah, you can bond. You can bond with different people mm-hmm. from different areas. Mm-hmm. Yes, that's why I say you know very important. You know, we're facing, mm-hmm. and then today we're have, we're facing each other. We have a conversation, mm-hmm. and especially now, this world is dividing. Yeah, you know, especially like after COVID nineteen, people still. Afraid, mm-hmm. you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Yeah, cannot be themselves. Yeah, and cannot find themselves. Yeah, that's why we need to send message messages out mm-hmm. to bridge them together. Mm-hmm. Yeah, right. Put, bring to bring their lives back mm-hmm. to normal. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So that's very important. Is yeah. just how to still keep connection, still keep connection, and give you know uh, courage to each other in facing difficulties such as COVID nineteen. Exactly. Actually, for example, you know why we're here. Understand you we are here. Mm-hmm. We like Buddha teach teach me. For example, you Buddha said Buddha teach us. Yeah, yeah. Or God teach us mm-hmm. to be good people. Mm-hmm. Yeah, want to do good things, mm-hmm. don't do bad. Yeah, you know yeah. what I mean. <laughs> Try to spread peace, love, respect, yeah. courage. Yeah, to others, mm-hmm. to help each other. Mm-hmm. Instead, like uh, angry each other. Right. I, I don't like you. You don't like me. Right. Right. Wasting wasting lifetime. Yeah, with some energy. Mm-hmm. Why are you doing that? Right. Yeah. Right. Why just use, use your energy and to help yourself to help mm-hmm. others? Yeah, I'm. I, Sifu is definitely very <laughs> open-minded because yeah. I think part of the reason they call you the rebellious monk is because you don't do what normal monks do, but you are very open-minded. You are able to connect with all different life of people that makes you very special, and I think that's a great example to live in New York City. That if you wanna, if you wanna pass down something good to others, you need to sort of be f- more free. You don't want to lock yourself up in the old traditional form. Exactly, you don't lock yourself up by the traditions. Some mm-hmm. traditions are fantastic. Mm-hmm. Some traditions are not mm-hmm. so great. <laughs> and I, I disagree. For example, I'm not going to judge anybody. I'm not going to judge Buddha. Mm-hmm. I want to judge myself. Mm-hmm. I teach my people: don't judge other people. Mm-hmm. Only judge yourself. Yeah, yeah. Don't judge. Only judge yourself. That's the way to live life. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? You don't know them. You never spend time with them. Yeah. How can you judge them? Right. right. And that's that's intrigued. Mm-hmm. <laughs> first, first. Sure. For example, in the traditions, in in a, in a monastery temple, mm-hmm. the monk, the monks, are two hundred fifty rules. 250 rules. Right, right. But it's nuns, the woman who shave their head and wear robes. Mm-hmm. 500. First, first, that, that's not even. <laughs> Everybody should treat equal. Right, we, right, we should, right, right. We should take that out first. Uh-huh, okay? uh-huh. Yeah. Everybody should respect each other. Mm-hmm. Don't think, I, I don't think I, I'm, I'm sure for, oh, I'm, I have a power. Right. And, and and abuse my power, dis, dis, uh, disrespect other people. Mm-hmm, I mm-hmm. don't do that. Mm-hmm. Just like parents. Yeah. Of course, parents you have power. Whatever you you say to your children, they have to listen. Mm-hmm. It, that's I, I understand that that's abuse your power. <laughs> right. Respect. We're human. We're all people. Mm-hmm. Respect equally. I think that's the best way to go. Yeah. yeah. So be very. Uh, yeah. So it sounds like you are uh, words. The words you say, you practice them I yourself. Do. Yeah. yeah, I do. Yeah. They're very important, you know. I treat everybody equally. You know, you give love. You give love, you receive love. Mm-hmm. Yeah. The best, I, 
my best gift I received by two change people mm-hmm. and to help them. They they help themselves. They change themselves mm-hmm. and become better human beings. Mm-hmm. Yes. So I, I think uh, yeah. that's a wonderful lesson you have. And, <laughs> and I think yeah. if yeah. I remember our conversation earlier, you also your Shaolin Temple here also do things to help the community for free because not everyone can afford to take Shaolin Temple lessons. So can you say a little bit about the charity work? That you have done for the neighborhood. Yeah, ch- church working for the neighborhood for the for the rest of the world. I can say that okay. because I have uh, I have students come from different countries, mm-hmm. from Africa, from Russia, wow. Europe, South America. Yeah. Also, I teach people on the line, online, yeah, online. Mm-hmm. Live life by to make wonderful examples. Live life by example. Mm-hmm. That's why I said we cannot. Make excuses in our lives. Mm-hmm. People stop making excuses. Don't make excuses in life. When you start to make excuses, the excuses never go away mm-hmm. because they love you. Because you looking for them, they come to you. Mm-hmm. You're bonded. You're building the relationship. Mm-hmm. That's why stop making excuses in life. Yeah, too hot, too cold, mm-hmm. and windy, snow, raining, outside nasty. That's part of life. That's what make our life brilliant mm-hmm. and precious. Yeah. yeah, I think people should understand that. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that, that's 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 why it's very important to understand that's the point. Mm-hmm. So, so it sounds like you are able to provide service to people from any anywhere, even from uh, pro- pro- neighborhood to online. Exactly, providing you know, the, uh, the service to the people. Mm-hmm. That's why I'm here. I was, you know. Understand yourself. I teach people. Understand yourself. Why you're here, mm-hmm. and live meaning for life. Do something good mm-hmm. for yourself, mm-hmm. for others. If you have you have children, <laughs> generation to generations, mm-hmm. and they look up you, you have something to talk about. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? It's so proud. Your, your children are so proud of you. Yeah, why you you doing fantastic? Yeah. For for the, for the people, for mm-hmm. the world. Yeah. That's why that's why I have line online courses, and every Saturday, uh-huh. every Saturday, live live stream, every Saturday afternoon, live stream. Okay. Yeah, I said, I I want people to see it. I'm not sick. Maybe I'm, people think I'm sick. I'm so happy. <laughs> how's how's happy? Say Merry Christmas, Happy New Year. Yeah, Merry Christmas, Happy New Year. Feliz La Vida. Uh huh. And Feliz Año Nuevo. You know, always happy. I never, I don't understand what that means uh, in my life. So, yeah. so every Saturday you have a live stream for I guess for our audience if they want to check you out they can. Uh, well, yeah, we have live stream. Also, we have online uh, online classes. Uh huh. Yeah, online classes they yeah. can check you out. Let people realize you know life, life is living. Uh huh. Life, we're living life, we're life. Okay. Life is exercising. Mm-hmm. You don't exercise your life. Life is just change. Yeah, you know, we getting younger, younger mm-hmm. every year. You have to church yourself. Mm-hmm. You have, you have to exercise your uh, precious life. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So the spirit of Chan is to really cherish time, cherish life, and live our fullest. Fully, you know, fully join. Mm-hmm. Yeah, life is so beautiful. Yeah, so precious. <laughs> Why not right. enjoy it? Right, right. Live right. well mm-hmm. and enjoy it. Yeah, yeah, makes sense. Yeah, be happy. Yeah. <laughs> so I mean, I, 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 well, I could yeah. see you uh, yeah. very uh, full of energy. I, I love it. Yeah. Very, uh, f- very, yeah. very positive. It sounds like it's, and it seems like you do what you say in ter- in terms of like. Sounds like you're still practicing every day the Shaolin Kung Fu every day. What is your typical schedule in a day? My typical typical schedule, and I train every day. Okay. Yeah, that's what every Saturday afternoon, live stream. Oh, you you stream uh, your stream, practice. I practice not a one. That's not enough. Okay. I practice early morning or later evening. I okay. Practice. Okay. I sharp myself. Uh huh. Yeah. That's that's why I respect myself. I said people come to me, want to you know study some, for example, action meditation. Mm-hmm. I call action meditation. Action meditation. Yeah. 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 Or, or ph- philosophy, whoever. Mm-hmm. Everybody come to me, have different purpose. Mm-hmm. You know, I have to have. 
get something to share with them. Mm -hmm. Otherwise, don't call me chef. I, not, I, I, I cannot handle it. Right, I, right. I don't deserve it. Mm -hmm. yeah, people call me chef. Right. You, have to, you have to stay you know, sharp. Mm -hmm. you know, first, first, master yourself. Yeah. yeah. People are interested in action meditation, which because for some of our audience, usually when they think of meditation, they think of it as a sitting meditation. Right. And, and so, so we want our audience to know that, that meditation is a training of the mind. It does, it's not always in sitting, but it's also in action. Absolutely, yes. For our audience who's interested in this kind of action meditation, right. they should contact you because you're the very first person who really advocate this kind of martial art meditation in America. And it sounds like, based on what you said, it kind of gives us sort of a good idea on how when you combine martial art and spirituality, it really gives us a sense of confidence and freedom right. and, and really help us to face difficulties in life. Right. You know, right. meditation, everything can be, can be used. For example, play golf, go right. play tennis, go to swim, jogging, right. Right. and climb the tree like a monkey. Mm -hmm. you, everybody is beautiful. You have to find your way yeah. to meditate your life. Mm -hmm. okay? You cannot use one way just sitting there and meditate. Right. Sitting there too long, you damage your joints, mm -hmm. your lower back. Right. Numb, your, numb yourself. Mm -hmm. Luckily, you have cell phone with you these days. You, you imagine hours later, you cannot get up. Uh -huh. You cannot get up. Just yeah. sit there until somebody can, can see you, can help you to get up. <laughs> <laughs> that's that's what I call action meditation. Uh -huh. Like speaking, mm -hmm. you can meditate. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Speaking, walking, walking, eating, eating exactly. Right, singing, dancing. Right, right. Rapping, you know. Yeah. Check out. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Everything can, everything can be. Everybody's different. Mm -hmm. Everybody's different. Yeah. Yeah. That's just like Buddha said. There are a million different doors. Sure. Yeah. Sure. And but different doors for different people. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Just like different way to. To, uh, for different people individually mm -hmm. and to meditate yeah. yeah to make life better sure that's right you can upside down mm -hmm. you can stretch your legs that's right that's right <laughs> yeah so yeah. it is uh, very good I think that we're very happy to have civil you on our show because we want to we want our audience to know that the spirit of a Chan is very free and the way to train our mind is not just one form but it's formless right so this is I, I, absolutely, there, there are many ways. Mm -hmm. yeah. Yeah, don't limit yourself. Mm -hmm. Don't draw a line. Yeah, don't label yourself. I cannot do this. You can. Mm -hmm. Yes, you can. Yes. Yeah. Can we do it? Yes, you can. Can can we do it? Yes, we can. <laughs> yeah. First, first, you have to believe yourself mm -hmm. and trust yourself. Okay. You have confidence in, in, in you. You have to get up, do it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Find a way. Mm -hmm. Be yourself. Mm -hmm. That's the best. Yeah. So, just do it. Just do it. Just do it. Just do it. So, for example, you you know, yeah. What what are you waiting for? You you don't do it. Mm -hmm. Your life is every every year we, we, every day we get younger younger. Right. As a younger, you don't cherish yourself. Right. Who cherishes you? Mm -hmm. If you cherish yourself, make yourself very knowledgeable person, mm -hmm. very strong, very healthy, very happy person. Mm -hmm. You reflect. You reflect on your loved ones. Mm -hmm. You're happy, you're healthy, you're strong. Eh? You're a very like, a beautiful, phenomenal person. Mm -hmm. You're reflecting on your loved ones, your families, your best friends, who are close to you. At the same time, you help, you help them. Mm -hmm. Just look at you. Wow, I want to be like that. You know? right. That's right. very important. Yes. Yeah, yeah. First, first understand and, and people. Mm -hmm. yeah. 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 C connection, freedom. Freedom, exactly. Yeah. Yeah, mm -hmm. uh, uh, open mind, open heart. Open mind, yeah. open heart. Yeah, find mm -hmm. yourself, mm -hmm. be yourself. Yeah, that's the best. That's the way to live life. So yeah. thank you Sue, yeah. for so much yeah. of your wisdom sharing with us. Where I personally are very happy to have a conversation with you, and I, I'm sure our audience also would have a very you know interesting, you know, uh, experience just listen to us. Any final words for our? Audience to take I, home. I, I'm very happy you come to me. And uh, <laughs> I, wow, time goes by quickly. Thirty years. I, I know just, when you yeah. when you met me, I ha I had hair. <laughs> <laughs> now I don't. <laughs> now we're even. <laughs> That's fantastic. Beautiful. 
because you grow in you know, a knowledge and doesn't matter to her not her like a monk right your monk doesn't mean you have to shave head uh -huh. you, you 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 can have long hair mm -hmm. you don't have you don't have to wear robes mm -hmm. like you you can be a monk <laughs> okay. you're a monk a monk means to make a wonderful relationship mm -hmm. spreading peace love respect courage yeah very intelligent person mm -hmm. yeah that's monk means yeah <laughs> monk doesn't yeah. mean uh, has, uh, has to live inside a monastery mm -hmm. People, uh, the monk can, can be live on the street. Mm -hmm. The homeless, the you know, people get people help mm -hmm. and get people love. Yes. Yes. In people, for example, that moment needs needs help. Who needs help? Mm -hmm. the homeless can help. That's that's monk. Sure. That's Buddha. Sure. That's Bodhisattva. That's that's God. Mm -hmm. Anyway, final words. <laughs> final words. Life is so precious, everybody. Mm -hmm. And cherish it. Yeah. Live well. Be happy. Mm -hmm. Don't stress. Don't be stressed. Don't worry about too much about life. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Eat good food. Watch your diet. Exercise. Yeah. Don't believe, you know, I'm monk. I cannot go to the church. Mm -hmm. What? Well, no difference. Mm -hmm. Yeah. First, of all, open your mind. Mm -hmm. Yeah. They all all good. Yeah. If you're good, you mm -hmm. understand. Your knowledge. You're a very knowledgeable person. Mm -hmm. Everything is fantastic. Yeah. Just like people ask me, which kind of uh style of martial arts is best. Mm -hmm. Every style is best. If you're best, you can make everything best. You know what I mean? Sure. There's no there's no good, no bad. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And Th thank you so much, Sifu. Thank, you. thank you so much, Sifu. And I hope you enjoy our conversation with Sifu Siyamin. Remember, peace, respect, love. Yo! The peace, love, respect, the reason, the Jesus, the master killer, OTV, or the boss, you know what I'm saying? The Memphis Medics. Chef Rui Kwan. Aye, what's up? Peace. Stay tuned. Aye. <laughs>